Howdy horse lovers and gaming enthusiasts, today we're diving into the virtual stables to explore the best horse games of 2024. From wild adventures to cozy simulations, we've got it all. But before we settle up, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Stay tuned to the end because we've also included a few upcoming horsey game gems you might want to keep your eye on. Number one is The Sims 4 Horse Ranch. Embark on a Sims 4 adventure with the Horse Ranch DLC. With The Sims 4 now being free to play, acquiring the Horse Ranch DLC opens up a world of possibilities. You can do things like design and personalize your own horse ranch, create a charming stable, and decorate your ideal barn. You can also have fun creating your dream horse or horses in your create sim and live out your equestrian dreams in the form of pixel ponies. But that's not all. The Sims 4 Horse Ranch PC players have access to things like mods and other creative content. The Sims 4 Horse Ranch custom content breathes even more life into your horses and world. From cute custom horse tack to unique mane and tail styles, and even intricate coat stencils and stamps, the Sims 4 Horse Ranch creators are passionate and generous, often sharing their creations for free. While some creators may charge for their content, a substantial amount of TS4 Horse Ranch CC is available without cost. This means you have access to an endless array of content constantly replenished by the vibrant and creative Sims 4 Horse Ranch community. Number two, Ranch of Rivershine, early access adventure. The Ranch of Rivershine demo is now available on Steam if you haven't heard about it already. Move into your new ranch, buy horses at the auction house, and train them to compete in cross country to help the town folk of Rivershine. While it's still an evolving game in early access, constant development means you'll always find something new to explore, build, and shape the ranch of your dreams. You can saddle up and embark on the ultimate horse ranching adventure with Ranch of Rivershine. Build your dream ranch, raise adorable foals, and forge a deep connection when you care for your magnificent horses. The world is fun to explore. There are jumps throughout each area, which makes it fun to travel around, and you can train your horse for the thrilling cross-country competitions and watch your horses grow up before your eyes. If you look on the Steam page, there's a ton of positive reviews. People saying that this is the horse game they always dreamed of, a mix of competing, care, and breeding, without anything that feels like a chore. It's the perfect cozy game and art style to just immerse you. The game is super in depth for an early access game, and it is made by a single dev that barely made a dent in her own roadmap for the final release. So I'm super excited for what else is to come. We've already gotten updates with full care, and there's lots of cute little accessories and tack that you can now buy doesn't have the same realism as other upcoming games like Astride or Unbridled, it makes up for all of that with its extensive gameplay. There's so much to do, and I honestly love looking at my horses just wandering around in the pasture and exploring the world with all of them. Seeing what foals that I can raise is also an exciting little tidbit, and there's stores for you to buy lots of cute little accessories. The map is nice, it also teleports you right back to the entrance, so you also don't have to worry about getting lost. Check it out on Steam. Now, this is a change of scene. You might be saying, why am I looking at Red Dead right now? And you are, but this is the Rift Red M, an equestrian sandbox. Dive into the world of Red Dead Redemption 2 on PC with the Rift Red M. Imagine Red Dead, but tailor-made for horse enthusiasts. Trail rides, breeding, competitions, like look at this horsemanship competition we just had. We've taken the horse mechanics and added a touch of magic. You can ask any horse lover's favorite thing about Red Dead, and it's the uncomparable horse mechanics. The horses respond realistically and seem to have personality. Well, in our Rift Redemption server, you can play as the horse, you could play as the person. Red Dead Redemption 2 is not a horse game. It is the best horse game that was never meant to be a horse game. So my community and I have taken full advantage of all the amazing horsey aspects of Red Dead and created our own Red M server called the Rift Red M. Before you get too excited, you need to be able to have a computer that can handle playing Red Dead Redemption 2, which isn't an easy task. While The Sims 4 Horse Ranch is easy to run, Red Dead Redemption 2 is not as easy and it's because it's such a realistic game. If you're lucky to have RDR2 or RDO standalone on PC, you can play on Red M servers. There's tons of different Red M servers. And just for a little overview, they use the framework of Red Dead Redemption 2, and it allows players to create and join custom multiplayer servers, similar to 5M. 
While not all Redem servers are the same, ours is very different than other people's. We don't require you to role play, but we offer a ton of community related horse events, whether it's horse shows, trail rides, cattle drives, you name it, we do it. If it's horse related, we will have it. Horse breeding, competitions, the sky is truly the limit. We just ask that you be 18 years or older to join us. So now we're going to Rival Stars, which is number three. Rival Stars Horse Racing is by Pickpock, and it's worth noting because it's a top horse game for me. So there is a PC release, and there's also a mobile version. While the mobile game has more horse breeds, regular updates, and events, it's worth noting they both have their own unique experiences. While the PC version is a one-time payment to play, be sure to get it on sale. It doesn't have much of the glitz and glam as the mobile version, but it is free from microtransactions. It has cost country, steeplechase, and you can do the flat racing as well. The mobile game is a little bit different. Now it does have microtransactions, but it is free to play. It is different breeds such as the Cell Francais and Arabians. More races like steeplechase, cross country, and flat racing as well as events. It's here because this horse racing game that really adapted and listened to its community and added more Pixel Pony content. Despite saying they weren't going to update the game as much on PC, I've been pleasantly surprised with all the things they've added. I highly suggest you check it out. There's a tremendous amount of potential that I believe is still going to be added to this game and the graphics are pretty fantastic. The racing is fun, and honestly, the mobile platforms community is a riot. This game's also here because you can play it on iOS, Android, or the PC. So it's very versatile. And I mean, look how cute the babies are. You can breed your own horses, you can take pictures of them, you can free ride, do competitions. There's pretty much endless possibilities, and I just gotta say it's really grown on me. So here we are with Unbridled That Horse Game. I did a longer video on this game because it is very near and dear to my heart. While still in development, Unbridled That Horse Game is out on Steam as a demo. If you have the chance to be a part of the creation process and witness this game being made, it's really going to be something truly special. To check out my video, uh, click the link up here in the right hand corner. It's worth noting that while it is a demo, it's getting regular updates. While it started off as just a horse creator, I gotta say they've added a lot of content. You can do some show jumping, some cross country, and I gotta say, I have a lot of fun creating my horses. This one is named Shroot. Really like the animations in this game. I'm excited to see where it develops. And I know that there's like not a whole lot to do, but I think that it's worth noting that the demo already includes a lot more than other demos. And I'm just really excited because the dev is so passionate about this game. The ultimate horse experience, giving you the freedom to follow your own dreams and create your own unique story. You can experience the freedom of riding, the challenges of horse sports, and the joy of breeding horses, all in this beautiful, stunning world. You can check out Unbridled That Horse Game over on Steam. It is an early access, so please keep that in mind, and the release date is to be announced. If you don't mind waiting, I suggest you keep an eye on this game because it does offer a unique experience that I think you're going to like. In the most recent update, there was a store added. You can see there's going to be quests, but there's also the ability to buy your horse cute little Christmas things like a blanket, which I think is pretty cool. But now let's move to Horse Life Simulator. So I don't know if you've heard of this game yet, but I'm pretty excited about it. Fredrickson Games is crafting a horse life simulator, a real life open world RPG that focuses on the realistic horse behavior, care, riding, and training. It'll be a non-quest based simulator, inspired by everyday scenarios in different types of stable environments and horse sports. We'll focus on realistic horse behavior, horse care, riding, and training process. 
You can design your own horse. There wasn't a ton of options, but I am in love with the horse mechanics. The way the horse crests its neck when it jumps is sometimes an overlooked detail you don't often see. The horse's feet also respond to the ground poles and the calvetis, which I've never seen in a horse game thus far. Check out Fredrickson Games, creating Horse Life Simulator on Patreon. Next is Rising Star. This cute little game is also in development, and you can immerse yourself. Rising Star is a relaxing horse care simulator with immersive horsemanship tasks and management features. Your grandpa owns a stable, which was one of the most important equestrian academies of Tuscany, but now you're old enough to take care of it. In it, it's your turn to bring the academy up to shine again. So there's show jumping training, water jumps, combination oxers, verticals, walls, and more. There's horsemanship tasks. So you can even cook on a little cooking mini game, which I think is super cool. You don't often see that type in a game, and I'm excited. The graphics are also adorable. Don't forget to check them out on Steam and add them to your wish list. All right, here we go. Fern Hoof Grove, an upcoming cozy game. Join me in anticipating Fern Hoof Grove, an upcoming horse game set in the small town with beautiful surroundings. The graphics are just simply adorable. There's multiple horse breeds and engaging activities await. Get ready for an immersive experience that's bound to capture your heart. Check out Burn Hope Grove and join the Discord to learn more. Okay, so here is the Tales of Rain Ravine. Last but certainly not least, it's a new indie equestrian game that's been in the making for a little bit. The focus is to bring you a totally new equestrian game experience with advanced riding mechanics, a variety of horses with unique temperaments, and a captivating story. The game will include show jumping, dressage, and cross country disciplines. I love that they say that the moves will be a little bit more advanced and complex because they did have a realistic show jumping option, which I thought was cool. You didn't have to play with that mode, but that fact that they let you choose that and be able to count the strides, I think is a really nice touch. Become a Patreon member and check out the demo. You need to know that you will need a Windows computer. Macs and Chromebooks do not work, at least not yet. If you do become a Patreon to further support this game or any of the other games mentioned, keep in mind you get additional content and exclusive updates in the game's development progress. So it's really worth it to invest in a game that you really wanna see come into full fruition because these games are expensive to make, very time consuming, and it's really hard work. A lot of these people are creating these games for us because they are passionate about horses and gaming, and I wanna do what I can to showcase everything that they've accomplished. While some games I mentioned were AAA games like Red Dead Redemption 2, even that has been completely transformed by people who have put the time and effort to create something truly unique. The people who create horse games are truly special. We're lucky to be alive at a time when so many people are working on games for us to enjoy. While it's hard to get everything perfect, I gotta say I'm really excited for what 2024 has in store for us as far as horse games go. Thank you so much for watching today's video and if you enjoyed don't forget to please subscribe and leave a thumbs up i'd love to hear your comments and feedback on the games that i've mentioned i'd like to make more of these videos because there's a lot of intricacies i feel like a lot of people don't know thanks for watching and happy trails